In this video, I will be going over the lies and misinformation Mark provides in Flat Earth Clues Part 1, The Empty Theatre. Here are the clips I will be going over. Releasing the movie 2001 A Space Odyssey in 1968, right before the actual moon missions, was no accident. It took the greatest director of all time five years to make, and several people who saw the theater screenings claimed that many military groups were listed in the credits only to be removed years later. No fact-based movies were made regarding it until The Right Stuff was released in 1983. Now you might say that it had only been 11 years, and maybe it was tough to get the rights, and so on, but that's not what made the film interesting. The only other major motion picture that involved the actual moon program was Apollo 13 in 1995, a full 12 years later. Apollo 13 only covered a single moon orbit and no landing or close-up reference to the previous missions below them. And after 1995, that was it. Nothing. Yet in almost 60 years, there has never been a single moon mission movie based on actual events. Now to be fair, there was a TV miniseries in 1998 covering the subject. It was produced by Tom Hanks, who got involved after starring in Apollo 13. There has been no professional production of any kind since then. Now Mark, I would love to know where you found this out. And several people who saw the theater screenings claimed that many military groups were listed in the credits, only to be removed years later. Because I haven't found anything on this. If anyone can let me know where Mark got this information, please get in touch. Because Mark, you can't just make up information. That's called lying. Not only will the most basic Google search disprove everything Mark says, he also manages to contradict himself within the same video. The only other major motion picture that involved the actual moon program was Apollo 13 in 1995 a full 12 years later. Then he states that there has never been a single moon mission movie based on actual events. Monk, what do you think the Apollo 13 movie was about? It was based on the supposed actual events of the failed moon landing. If Mark was as smart as he thinks he is, or even a competent human being, he would know that the movie Apollo 13 is based off the Apollo 13 mission which was the third intended mission to land on the moon. The entire Apollo missions are based around the moon. The only reason it didn't land on the moon was because an oxygen tank exploded. So besides the fact that there have been well over a handful of movies based on the moon mission, here are a few. For All Mankind, 1989, Apollo 11, 1996, Apollo 13, 1995, Magnificent Desolation, 2005, In the Shadows of the Moon, 2007, Mission Control, The Unsung Heroes of Apollo, 2017, Houston, We've Got a Problem, 1974, Moonwork 1, originally released in 1970, Footprints on the Moon, 1969. Mark, you are either an idiot or a liar. So, not only does Mark contradict himself, he also shows how idiotic he is. He obviously hasn't done any research. The movie Moonwalk 1 is a film about the flight of Apollo 11. The film was released in 1971, two years after the mission. While this doesn't disprove the flat earth, it does shine a light on some of the lies Mark tells. Mark Twain says, get your facts first, then you can distort them as you, as you please. Mark can't even do that. But 2001 is just a side note of this clue. For those who really want to dig into Stanley Kubrick's hidden vision, I highly recommend the documentary Room 237. A link to it is below as well. Oh, so you'll link to a documentary about a movie, but you won't link any of your references. And when I ask you to provide them, you simply ignore me? I wonder why that is, Mark. Mark. 